I am literally so mad. I get a call from my son's teacher. My son is in second grade and he is seven years old. She tells me, I'm so sorry that I have to tell you this. I'm so sorry that I even have to repeat this, but your son um, got into it with another student and the student told him that she didn't like him because he was black. So as you can imagine, just hearing those words, it's like a, a literal, I don't even know if I can cuss on here, but it's, it's like a literal stab to your heart as a mother to hear something like that was said to your child. I literally felt, I literally felt pain. Like I felt physical pain. I felt like she called me and told me that, that he had got hurt physically. Um, so then I'm finishing talking to her. Then uh, my son walks in five minutes later and he tells me what happened. This is what happened. The little girl in his classroom, a little Brazilian girl, um, is playing with a bandana, one of her toys, a bandana toy, whatever. She's letting everyone see it. And my son said, oh, can I see it? And she said, no. And he said, why? And she said, because I don't like black people. So my son said, why are you being racist? My son knows very well what this is already. I have already discussed this with both of my children, six and seven years old. Um, he says, he says, why are you being racist? What is the problem with being brown? And she says, it's disgusting. Okay, a little seven-year-old minority herself, little seven-year-old girl, Brazilian, and a minority herself. So, as you can imagine, I get on my laptop and I started typing the email 